Hey guys, it's me again, and today I'm going to do a, a review of my custom that I just did earlier. And he's the Aquas and Pyrus Neo Dragonoid. A dual attribute Bakugan. Isn't this neat? Isn't this pretty neat? It's the Aqua symbol, and it's also Pyrus. Just pull the Pyrus feet and the Aqua's horns. Mm. Mm. Sorry. Yeah. There you go. He looks really, really cool. Doesn't come with any card. I'm just using this one as an example. If he has a recharge, if you have like a recharge card, and you have this Bakugan, it's like a custom. Sorry on that last video when I reviewed Helios, I said this was Baron. Sorry, this is act. This guy is actually Volt. This guy is actually Baron. Well, next to Ace. Yeah, this guy is Volt. Sorry about that. And you already know what this one says, so yeah. If it's a Pyrus and Aquas, you can take both attribute bonuses 140 and 0. So basically, this little Bakugan, which is 410. As you can see right there. I will also combine it with my Pyrus and Aquas Neo Dragonoid. So I need to find it. There it is. Yeah, I'll combine this one's G Power. 550 plus 410, that is 960. Yep, these two combined are 960 G's. 960 G's! Wow. That is combined G power right there. This one is 410. Originally. This one is originally 550. Yeah, 550. This one has dual attributes, so this guy is able to take this guy's actual G power, 550 plus 410. That is 960 plus 140, it's 1100 Gs. And that will definitely overpower your opponent. Unless if they set off an ability card that gives an extra 200 G's above your opponent's level, above like my level or something like that. Then I'll have to do a reverse card in order for that to happen. And then boom. I already beat the opponent. Yeah. I could also make this guy be a Vortex one too. So, um, yeah. This is my review of my Aquas and Pyrus custom, aka Aquirus Neo Dragonoid. Oh shoot! Oh no! Anyway, I dropped him. So anyway, bye guys.